So I think I'm going to try to do this uh, this song that um, I'm playing a couple. I'm playing some stuff that I've never really, I haven't really played much for people before. So it's a little bit nerve wracking. <laughs> So inappropriate. <laughs> um, this is a song that I wrote for a for a little Canadian independent film called Cloudburst, starring Olympia Dukakis. And um, you probably haven't seen it yet because it's not been released like theatrically or anything. It's going to festivals around the world and all, but it's a really nice film. And um, the director was like nice enough to reach out to me and tell me that uh, he liked my writing and stuff. And so he asked me to write a song for the film. And I I gave him what well, gave I wrote. I gave him three songs, actually. One of them I took too long to write, so it didn't make it in the movie. But he did use the other two in the film, so look for Cloudburst if, uh, if and when it comes out. It will be out. It's really good. Um, but it was also nominated for a Genie Award in Canada, which is like Canadians, the Canadian's version of the Academy Awards, only... I don't know if people, do people watch it up there. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> we have TV. Um, so I actually I just went up there a couple weeks ago and I went to um, I went to the the awards ceremony and they played my my uh, they played this song on the show while some figure skater skaters uh, skated it's very Canadian oh and it was introduced by Jason Priestley on national television I'm sorry Brandon Walsh said my name on TV and then I met him afterwards at the party. I actually met Jason Priestley and um, Sukyun Lee, who was also in a movie that I was an actor in called Short Bus. She was my date. I was really nervous to ask her to be my date to the Genies, but she said yes, and we went together. And um, she actually sort of knows Jason because they were going to work together, and so she introduced us. And um, <laughs> she was like, "Yeah, Jay was in Short Bus with me. You, you saw Short Bus, right?" And he's like, "Oh yeah, yeah, I remember." And they like sing the national anthem into that guy's ass, and, and I was like. That was my ass, Brendan. <laughs> that was me. Not the conversation I'd ever ex <laughs> dream about right now. It's Jason Priestley, but you know, life just doesn't really go the way you plan. <laughs> I guess I'm probably grateful for that. <laughs> or I'd be a missionary somewhere. <laughs> 